The shortest speech I have ever seen in Parliament like by, by the President. It has never happened. Looks like there were no serious issues to discuss with the Kenyan people. But, so, but more importantly, the President looked like somebody who is still in campaign mode, still campaigning, still talking about issues of uh, hustlers, still talking about the issues of bottom-up in the judiciary, he's still talking about uh, who was the opposition candidate and who was government candidate. Those are now things that are dead and buried. With the declaration of the results at Bomas, those things are behind Kenyans. The worst thing I've seen today is that the president is still issuing new promises. He had issued promises during the campaign. He had a plan and manifesto. Today he was issuing new promises that are very due to the Kenyan people. So I don't know, is it promises over promises over promises? What is so new for you? There, there, there are a lot of issues. Issues to deal with NSSF, the savings he's talking about. All those, those, those things will have been covered in his manifesto when he was campaigning. But more importantly also, he is cutting the current budget that we passed in April by 300 billion shillings. I hope when Treasury brings that supplementary budget to, to National Assembly where I sit as the Chief Whip, I hope that they show us the items they are going to cut the budget from. Because we want to know where that money is going to be cut. You know, cutting a budget is cutting like your flesh. So we want to see where that flesh, is it the arm, is it the leg, is it the back, is it the stomach? We want to know where the President